Good day, Blackwater. This is Drad, Commander Drad, aka Phil. And I wanted to show you this thing I got. It's called ED Discovery. We mentioned it in chat. And this is just one of the many tools that it gives you. This is a map of the galaxy. Um, but it's only the sh stars that have been visited and mapped by players and then submitted to EDSM, the Elite Dangerous Star Map, which is an online database. So because I have a really awesome laptop, I scraped all the information all at once. So I have all this in, in RAM, but it doesn't all fit. So sometimes it swaps. So you can see there's chunks. The chunks are just things that are updating. So you can see it updates as I move around, it swaps out. So that's the whole galaxy. Those white lines are my paths through the galaxy. Um, this is the bubble, clearly. These black squares are bookmarks that people have made. I can actually shut those off, I think. I know that I can, I just don't know how, and I probably should have figured it out before I was actually doing this. Uh, let's see here. Okay. And then star naming is on. Okay. See this, this area here? Intriguing. People have been in the middle. That's the part that uh, freaked me out. It looks like a permit lock area. Maybe it's the starter area. I don't know. But uh, there's no notes there. So if we zoom in towards the bubble and look at my paths, this is the Pleiades. This is the, these are the Guardian sites. Saul's in there somewhere. Hedetet is in there somewhere. This little blob here is the region that we've been exploring, looking for our uh, for our stuff. And if you give it a minute, names will fill in. So we can figure out where people have been. Uh, these are lists of, as I said before, all the all the stars that have been submitted. So when I picked this region of space, I thought it was much more dead than than I thought. You know, I like it's. I tried to go. These, these lines across here, I'm not sure how well they're showing, are my path, well, and the paths of others between the Guardian sites and Maya for getting uh, the alloys. And I thought if I stayed below that, then, you know, it'd be a little dark, but it's not as dark as I would like. So there are other regions out here. Well, things are pretty busy near the bubble. I think that's pretty much the, the short version. Things in the bubble are busy. Anyways, this is it. This is the application. I hope that some of you find it useful. If you play on Xbox or PlayStation, it won't remember your path like these. But you can still grab the star map uh, if you've got a robust enough computer to contain it all at, at once. Have a great day, guys. Cheers.